Hi guys, hope you're all well. If you're new to Siege Studios, we're a premium miniature painting service with over 30 artists. Here at Siege we offer four painting levels, ranging from our bronze, premium gaming quality, up to our platinum competition standard. For your free quote today, follow the link in the description of this video. Hey guys, welcome to the showcase. We've got a real treat for you today. We're, let's have a look at these awesome, classic Imperial Guard Kazakhin Stormtroopers. Um, really, really iconic. Um, I think for me, the definition of a Stormtrooper are these models. I think these are probably my favourite version of Stormtroopers, the models that have ever existed. Um, really like the really cool Cadian kind of camo pattern as well. Uh, Nick is the artist here at Siege that's worked on these phenomenal models. Let's dive in and have a look at them in all their Imperial glory. So we'll start off by having a look at one of the regular troopers just firing away there. Again, I've always loved these really cool looking uh, hot, sort of hot shot las guns or hell guns. Um, again, loads and loads of awesome little details across these models. You can see that Nick's done a really nice job of picking out the lenses on the rifles. We've also got all the grenades and everything painted in that complimentary red. You've got that free-handed camo pattern all over all the armoured or the segmented carapace armour that these guys are wearing. Um, and again, you've got a free-handed kind of ace of spades on their shoulders as well, which is really, really cool because it's just the first of these awesome awesome stormtroopers obviously these are metal as well which is really nice because uh, they've got a nice weight to them which is just uh, really, very very reminiscent of my childhood uh, so it brings back some lovely memories uh, you've got the grenade launcher here with that great big lens there which is really cool all the sort of uh, optical lenses on the helmets are painted in a lovely blue just to really show that sheen of a visor as well which is just nice um, all the little dials and buttons are all painted uh, as well little sort of cables and things on the armoured suits of the backpacks are all done in a nice little black as well which is cool you've got all the little uh, details on the uh, sort of uh, backpacks all the little like lights and things all painted there as you can see the aquila and the skull all painted in a nice complimentary white really makes those stand out against that sort of greenish armor obviously k30 this unit number perhaps uh, and then obviously the ace of spades as well which is just free handed onto that pad which is lovely uh, so that's just him the sergeant which is really an iconic miniature I, i've always always loved the uh, the sort of saber that this guy's got i've used it on a numer numerous projects in the past but it's awesome awesome power saber kind of like a shimmer kind of thing that the sergeant is armed with all the eyes and everything painted there as you can see see Nick's done a really nice job of picking that out grenades the sergeant marking on the sort of leg or thigh piece of a uh, carapace armor there moving around you've got the power pack for obviously the hell pistol all the little lights and things done on the on the hell pistol as well which is just cool and all the little power packs on the backpack the little lights as I mentioned and uh, the, the individual cables and things for all these power things and that's again really love that saber just an awesome awesome weapon uh, so that's just the sergeant uh, and then we'll move through have a look at the flamer just so you can see the flamer chap again all the little screens and things on top of the little flamer on the readout of how hot the weapon's getting or something are all done which is cool all the little sort of side lenses on the helmets are all painted in that red as well you've got the massive red promethium tank there on the back um, perhaps don't want to stand too close to him uh, when you're advancing on a target <laughs> and uh, again the same consistency across all of these miniatures um, Nick's done a really lovely job of painting the classic uh, sort of Cadian sort of uh, stormtrooper camo scheme on these guys following the uh, sort of uh, GW artwork which is really nice uh, so this is another one of the regular troopers just firing obviously you're going to get the same kind of pose with the, with the metal sort of um, casts of the past there's uh, numerous different poses you've got this guy here it's like advancing cautiously which is quite cool like the kind of um lowered down kind of look, looking down the scope or the rifle bar barrel which is quite cool um if you elevated him perhaps on a, on a bit of rock or something it also looked like he's sort of executing someone perhaps of, of being at a higher sort of height which is quite cool so that's just this chap uh, again you can see all the grenades and everything all fully done k30 again written on his pad and then same again on that pose and then there's the other pose that there is from these uh, metal stormtroopers just to ease or just firing away there uh, which is quite cool but again some more grenades all highlighted in red all the lenses on the on the hell guns or the that are done there as well which is really cool uh, or the hot shot las guns should i say um they used to be called hell guns but still um but this awesome awesome set of models do love those blue visors they really work and uh, we'll look at one more uh, it's just the other cast which is a bit more at ease uh, which is again really cool so this is just him and uh, again a lovely Lovely, lovely. I do almost the helmets almost look like sort of uh, aviation kind of like pilot helmets, which I think is really cool uh, with those rebreathers on them as well, which is just nice. Uh, so again, just this final model to check out from this ten-man unit of classic Cadian Kazakhin stormtroopers, um, never forgetting Cadia, but still purging the enemies of the Imperium in Cadia's name. I hope you liked it, guys.
So thanks for watching the video guys, I hope that you have enjoyed it. While you're here on YouTube, help us out by subscribing to the Siege channel. We upload at least three videos a week, so make sure you hit that bell icon to be notified when a new video is live. To see more, go follow us on our other social media where you can keep up to date with what we get up to and interact with us. If you're looking to learn from us, we offer online tuition on Patreon and physical classes nationally in the UK. Finally, to get your free quote today, click the link in the description of this video. From all the team here at Siege and myself, a massive thank you for watching the video and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.